and Tom. Welcome to Super User TV here at the OpenStack Summit Barcelona. There's been a lot of chatter here about how the design summit's evolving. Can you all kind of talk about what attendees should expect in the next couple of months? Sure. It's probably the most popular question that we've gotten all week, so glad to talk about it today. But basically, right now, the way that the software is planned is, you know, every six months at the summit, we host the design summit alongside it. And um, we've just gotten feedback the last couple of cycles that the developers are basically, you know, too busy in the design summit to be able to participate in the rest of the summit and, you know, have the important conversations with users and have more strategic conversations across, you know, across the different projects. And also that those, those planning discussions were happening a little bit too late in the process. We run in this six month cycle, but by the time that we were at the design summit, we were into the next release cycle and have already made a lot of decisions. So basically we decided to take out, I would say about 70% of the design summit and put it into a separate event called the PTG, which will occur about two months beforehand. And that's where a lot of that like heads down, you know, implementation decisions type work will happen um, among the different project teams. And then, um, you know, keep those more strategic discussions and that opportunity to interact with users at a new event called the forum at the, at the summit. And the reason why we decided to change the name to the forum rather than keep it as the design summit is we, you know, we really want to show that this is a new event that's not completely developer led. It's going to be collaborative among the communities. So Maybe, I know Tom might be able to tell us more about that collaboration and how it's put together. Absolutely. Uh, Allison, we're really very excited with the new neutral way that the forum's going to be organized. We're going to get together representatives from the developers, from the users, the various working groups in OpenStack, and get them to put together to the, the schedule rather than having separate ops and developer sessions. Uh, at this stage, we think there's going to be three main types of sessions. As Lauren mentioned, there's going to be quite a few strategic discussions uh, for cross-community issues uh, and those kind of things. More to do with the te technical aspects and the project aspects, there's going to be the cross-project uh, sessions, which are similar to something that happens in the Design Summit today, but with much more of an emphasis on issues that are across the user side of things as well as just developer internal issues. Uh, in addition to that, there will be, of course, quite a number of project-specific sessions to talk about the latest ideas that users have for fantastic projects uh, in OpenStack and also uh, talk about the recent release that will have come out about three months before the summit. Awesome, so you have the PTG and the forum. So who should attend the PTG, the forum, and should some people attend both? Yeah, well, well that's, that's a great question. question. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think, you know, the biggest fear around this change is that means the developers are no longer going to come to the summit, and that's not at all the intention. Um, right now, the developers are going to the summit, and quite a few of them are also participating in these mid-cycle events where they're meeting up with their team and doing work. So effectively, we'll be you know, getting rid of the mid-cycles and having more of the focused work time at the PTG and more of the strategic conversations at the summit. So ideally, we'd like to have as many developers as possible attend both events. And to cap out the rest of the community, of course, the summit's always been a fantastic place for those who are running clouds and those who are developing applications on top of clouds. We want them to interact with all the developers on that neutral playing field and, and get together, as well as uh, our friends from places like product management. Uh, we need skills from a variety of areas to make sure we can achieve the open design aims. Awesome. So with these changes, how do you think, um, especially Tom, I know you work really closely with the operator community. How do you think this will impact the ops um, the ops meetups at the summit or the mid-cycle one as well? Absolutely. So uh, we will still have uh, operators mid-cycle, but to focus on the forum, uh, there will no longer be dedicated operator sessions. Instead, what we'd like to see is the various operator groups getting together with development teams and vice versa to plan sessions together. So uh, rather than having uh, a session in the ops uh, summit where operators are ranting about Neutron, and one in the Neutron session where developers are asking questions about operators. We want that activity to merge. We want developers to come with specific questions to ask operators. We want operators to come with bug links and feature ideas. And because of the timing and the release cycle change, we believe that it will be a really good uh, opportunity to have those discussions. Awesome. Yeah. Well, thanks for all taking the time to talk to us today. And I hope to catch up with all in February after the first PTG. I think it's, what, the second or third week or when? February 20th. Awesome, we'll talk to you all then. Thank you very much.